the intertransverse ligament. The intertransverse ligament is difficult to find because the trapezius comes up through here. So it's anterior to the trapezius. So you need to try and remember to stay anterior to that. You want to stay behind sternocleidomastoid, which goes from here to here. Um, so the transverse process of the cervical vertebra kind of sticks out on the side right in through here. So you're just anterior to the trap. It's a little bump that kind of sticks up there to be able to feel it. There's certain spots you won't be able to feel it well at all. But here you should be able to feel it. So you're just behind sternocleidomastoid and you're just in front of the trapezius. Pushing into the lateral side of the neck. And you're gently cross-fibering the intertransverse ligament on the transverse process of the cervicals. And you should be able to get from uh, C2 down to hopefully C7. And be aware of any referrals that you might possibly find. Now in some cases you need to go push down in front of the trapezius to get down into that, that ligament. It's usually pretty sensitive and you don't need a lot of pressure.